Now in the plow, his foot is gonna move. Now he moves up to the side, cross guard. He's on the weak and he comes in with the stab. Today we're gonna look at the ox and how to stab from an ox. Welcome to Cardozo Sword Sport. So normal ox, as I explained, is a lot of problems because you're moving up and the point is not coming closer. So let's say Diego is in a plow and now moves up to an ox and at the same time wants to stab and keep track of that point. Yeah, one more time. So the first bit before he moves up to an ox, nothing is, just move up to the, yeah, you see there, the point didn't move forwards at all. And then he starts initiating, but then you already given so much visual signals that all the flags, red flags are up. And while he's moving up his leg, everything is balancing on one leg. And then he's with his weak and on his strong, so there's no way he's gonna come through. Only when he wants to basically provoke Joris, maybe that would work by going suddenly to the other side or making a stab. Let's say that you're setting it up for a stab. So you come in and yeah, exact them all. But if you want to make a solid step, yeah, then you have to do it slightly different. Yeah, that's also a nice counter. What you need to do is make a slow pace with the right foot, like you see Diego doing now. And the same as yours doing. He is moving his right foot over the line of his left foot. And then you slide your sword upwards, missing your opponent with almost 45 degrees, so like a meter. You stab 45 degrees to the side, sliding your sword upwards, not putting pressure on the blade so you don't provoke a response, and then his sword is tip is caught in your cross guard and he cannot displace it anymore. And from that position you launch your ox. So to execute it perfectly you have to set it up. It's pretty good. Still a little bit more distance but then uh, it's really nice. Yes. Yeah, because your rear foot, you're every time too far out still. So, uh, Joris, can you do the move? Here you see Joris moving up first before he makes his lunge. Mm -hmm. One more time. So, you're standing in the plow. His right foot is going to move slightly to the left. He moves up to the plow position and now he comes with the lunge. And this is actually yeah. the secret of making a good ox, which cannot be resisted by your opponent. Yes, and instead of going like up and down, it's more like in one motion you go around the corner. Better. This is how you make a solid ox. So let's do it one more time, slow motion. You see Diego making the slow pace with his right foot, passing his left foot and moving upwards, sliding with no pressure, with his strong on the weak of the plow of yours, and only then the point comes inwards and he executes his ox. Go and uh, practice at home, doing the ox the right way.